대화를 듣고 남자가 찾고 있는 사람을 고르시오. Oh, I like this picture. Well, don't you recognize me in this photo? My, you? Are you in the marathon? Yes, I'll give you a clue. I've never won a marathon. Okay, so you're not the one in the middle. Then are you the one with the hairband? I've never had curly hair either. Then are you on the far left? No, I'm wearing a long-sleeved shirt. Then are you on the far right? I never wear long pants when I'm running. I got it. You are the second one from the left. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Excuse me, may I ask why you are here? I have an appointment with the manager. Okay, I'll just call him and check. What? Don't you believe me? Sorry, ma'am, I'm just doing my job. Just tell him that Sarah is here to see him. Okay, one more thing. You mustn't take any computer disks into the building. Don't worry, I don't have any with me. Of course not, but please let me check. Oh dear, I'm just visiting my customer. I didn't come to steal your company's ideas. 대화를 듣고 여자가 입장권 값으로 지불해야 할 액수를 고르시오. Excuse me, but when do you close? 9 p.m. Good, we've got two hours. How much is admission? Three dollars for adults. Are you alone? No, my husband, my daughter, and my son. Are your kids under 12? Yes, I believe they'll get a discount. Right, so two dollars for each kid. That's a good deal. Can I pay with a credit card? Sure. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 주말에 하려고 하는 일을 고르시오. How about lunch together this weekend? Thanks for asking, but I have another plan. So, what are you doing this weekend? Every weekend, I go to the civic hospital. Do you have to see doctors? No, I visit the sick and elderly and help take care of them. Oh, great. You volunteer your time at the hospital. I feel very good about helping others. Can I join you? Sure. Just come along with me and you can start right away. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. Good afternoon. How may I help you? I'd like to send this package overseas. How would you like to send it? I'd like to send it by registered mail. We'll have to know the value of the contents if you want to send that package by registered mail, ma'am. Oh, it doesn't have any commercial value. Okay, so what's in the package? I'm just sending some old clothes to my son. In that case, it would be cheaper to just send it by regular mail. How much will it cost? Put the package on the scale. 다음을 듣고 누가 누구에게 말하고 있는지 고르시오. Attention everyone, please. I'd like to make an announcement regarding tomorrow's performances. I want everyone to be on the stage no later than six o'clock. This will give you enough time to get into costume. The hair and makeup people will be doing their jobs, beginning with the main characters and working down to the minor ones. You've worked hard for the last three months, and you're ready to perform. Good luck! 다음을 듣고 아래표를 참조하여 어느 방송 프로그램의 일부인지 고르시오. Welcome back to the show. I'm Marion Simmons. My next guest is Ian Gibson of the Family Counseling Service at City Hospital. Today we are discussing the subject of jealousy among your kids. Ian is here to answer your questions about the problems between brothers and sisters. Hopefully, we can help families whose children are not getting along well with each other. Oh, here's the first question from a parent sitting in the front. 대화를 듣고 남자가 다이앤에게 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, quick moving service. May I speak to Diane? I'm sorry, but she's at lunch right now. Do you know when she'll be back? She'll be here in 20 minutes. May I ask who's calling? This is Ralph, her next door neighbor. May I leave a message? Sure, go ahead. I just wanted to tell her that a package was delivered to her apartment and I'm keeping it for her until she gets home. Okay, I'll tell her that you're holding a package for her. That's right, thank you. 대화를 듣고 남자가 화가 난 이유로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Aren't you looking for something? 
Yes. Did you see a small box anywhere around here? Where did you put it? It was on my desk earlier, and now I can't seem to find it. The only box I saw was empty. So what did you do with it? I threw it out a couple of hours ago. I can't believe it. What's in it? It contains some very important material, and I need it right away. I'm very sorry. I'll see if it's still in the trash. 태어를 듣고 남자의 심장을 묘사한 것으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Excuse me, which is the gate for the flight to London? Let me see. I'm sorry, but that flight has already left. Oh dear, when is the next flight? The next flight isn't until 11 o'clock tomorrow morning. That's a big problem. I'll attend a meeting tomorrow morning in London. Didn't you check your flight schedule? I did, but I was caught in traffic on the way. That's too bad. I should have left the office earlier. 대화를 듣고 여자가 원하는 직업을 고르시오. This is your third year at college. Yes, time flies. So, have you ever thought of what you'll do in the future? When I graduate, I want to work either as a consultant or a reporter of a TV program. Those are your two main interests. How about you, Carla? I will get out of this waitressing job, and I will save enough money to start my own interior decorating business. Think of you as a famous interior decorator. That sounds like fun. I hope your dream will come true. 다음을 듣고 가장 중요한 성공 요소로 여자가 말한 것을 고르시오. What do you think the most important factor to your success at work is? Surprisingly, it's not what school you went to or how much education you have. According to data, there are three basic factors that affect your success at work. One factor is technical skill, one is logical ability, and one is emotional intelligence. Which factor most affects your success? Emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence refers to how well you are able to build relations with others, and it leads to success better than the other two factors. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Shall we go bowling or play tennis? Suit yourself. 2. Would you like to leave a message? No, thanks. I'll call back later. 3. Do you want to go hiking? I'll just stay home and relax. 4. Do you want something cold to drink? Great. I'm really thirsty. 5. Hurry up and get dressed. I think we can make it to the party. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Sorry to bother you. Could you take our picture? Sure. Do you want to be together in the picture? Yes, and we'd like to have the beautiful temple behind us. Okay, I see. So how do I use this camera? It's easy. Just press the big red button. You are too far away. Can you come closer? Yes, no problem. How's this? Now you're not in the middle of the picture. So where do we need to be? 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Oh, the time has gone by so fast. Yes, but that always happens when you're having a good time. So, when do you get your plane home? Early tomorrow morning. So this is your last evening here? I'm afraid so. Well, here is a gift for your wife. Please say hello for me. Oh, thank you so much for your hospitality. You've been so nice to me. Don't mention it. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Oh, it's very crowded here. Yes. During rush hour, the subway gets very busy. Oh, there's a seat. Why don't you take it? Good. Oh, but there's an elderly woman. I'll let her have it. That's kind of you. There are two old people standing over there. They look very tired. There are some high school kids sitting in front of them. They should offer their seats to the old people. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 탐이 베티에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Tom asks his friend Betty if she'd like to go to the movies, but Betty says she cannot go. 
Betty explains that she must meet some other students to practice for a play. Tom is very surprised because Betty is quite shy, and he cannot imagine Betty acting on stage in front of many people. However, Betty seems very excited about being in the play. She tells Tom that the performance will take place next week. Betty invites him to come and see it. How does Tom most likely reply to Betty? Tell me, Excuse me, where's the post office, please? Sure. You see that school down there on your left? Yes. Well, pass the school. Walk down and you can see the two buildings on your right. Okay, I see those buildings. Which one is it? Not one of those. What do I do then? Keep walking until you come to the intersection. Yes, you mean the second intersection? Yes. Turn left there, and there's one on your right. Okay, thanks a lot. How are you? Just fine. How are your classes going? Pretty well. How about you? What class are you taking today? Modern Logic by Professor Keynes. I was told that his class is worth taking. I agree. I would say he's a genius. I'm not sure if I can take his class. Why are you hesitating? Because I do not have any background in logic. Why don't you sit in on his class for a week and see if it's okay? That sounds good to me. Hi, let's go for lunch. What would you suggest as a gift for Kate? You said you're going to get her a nice pen. Well, I wanted to order a nice pen. Then, did something go wrong? Kind of. The company said it would take five days to have it delivered. Oh, no! Kate's birthday is just two days away. Right. Today is Monday. We've got only two days. What are you going to do? I guess I'll have to go shopping today and buy something else. Who is it? I'm from Circuit Electronics. I've brought your air conditioner. Come on in. It's two days behind schedule. Sorry, ma'am. We have received so many orders. It's finally here today, but I seem to be missing the remote control. Really? Let's look in the box again. Yes. All the items are in here, as well as the user's guide, all except for the remote control. I'm really sorry about that. Let me send you another one right away. When can I have it? I'll get it to you this evening. Oh, look at the gardens. Yes, they're very beautiful. But let's look at the king's rooms. Okay, but I'm curious to know the history of this place. Is there an information booth? I'm not sure, but I know that one of the old rooms has been made into a museum. Oh, that would be interesting. It will teach us more about the palace. Does anyone still live here? No. The royal family used to stay here sometimes, but not anymore. I wish I could live in a place like this. Thank you for bringing me here. This is considered one of the most important inventions in history. We use this to move heavy things. Every type of transportation has this. Cars, bikes, trains, motorcycles. Without this, transport would never have been possible. You see this everywhere and every day. We even need this to go rollerblading. And we see this on shopping carts. Oh, you won't believe what I saw today. Go on, tell me about it. Well, there was a guy laying down on the street. Was he hurt? Well, that's what I thought at first. A crowd gathered around and someone called an ambulance. So what happened? Well, the ambulance came, but he just smiled and said he was just relaxing, so the ambulance left. He sounds a little crazy. Not really. A moment later, a car started turning into where he was laying down. And so? He got up and a woman parked her car there. Then they went to a restaurant together. 
Ah, so he just wanted to save her the parking space. 태어를 듣고 여자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Tower cleaning. How may I help you? I just received the clothes I sent to be cleaned. Is there any problem with them? Yes. One of my skirts seems to be missing. Let me check our records. May I have your name? It's Kate Moss. Okay. How many items of clothing did you send for cleaning? There were three skirts and a jacket. Only two of the skirts were returned to me. I'm very sorry about that. I'll take a look for them. I hope they're not lost. 대화를 듣고 여자가 걱정하는 이유로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. We've got meat and fish. Are we done with shopping for the party? Well, all we need now is the fruit and cheese. How much do we want? I need to buy apples, pears, and melons. We need one box of each kind, and I think we need a selection of about ten different cheeses. Do you really think we need that much? Well, I'm concerned that more people could come. Oh, I think it'll be more than we need. We can serve other things like crackers or chips. Yes, but I would prefer to have too much rather than not enough. 대화를 듣고 여자의 부모에 대한 설명과 일치하는 것을 고르시오. What's your plan for the weekend? My parents are coming to visit for a couple of days on Friday. Really? You must look forward to having them around. Sure. Where do you think I should take them? Well, have they ever been here before? No. This will be their first visit. Would they be interested in city life? I don't think so. They don't like big cities. They've lived in small towns all their lives. How about giving them a tour of an old palace? That sounds like a good idea. 대화를 듣고 남자가 다음 주에 하려고 하는 것을 고르시오. You look quite upset. What's wrong? I'm in big trouble. Does it have something to do with your work? Yes, I just spent the whole day taking pictures in the mountains. So, is there any problem with the pictures? Yes, there wasn't any film in the camera. Oh, sorry to hear that. Anyhow, you'll have to do it again. Are you going back to the mountains tomorrow? No, I have to go to New York. Oh, you have a busy schedule. Then when? I'll have to get back to the mountains next week. Make sure you have film in the camera. Bye. 다음에 듣고 남자가 무엇에 관해서 말하고 있는지 옳은 것을 고르시오. Welcome to the Grand National Park. I'd like to take this opportunity to remind you about a few of the basics. Grand National Park is a beautiful place, and we need every one of you to help keep it this way. First, we ask that you take out whatever you've brought in. Next, please don't wash yourself or your clothes in the streams. Use the facilities provided in the campgrounds. Finally, the most important thing is to be very careful with fire. Fires are only permitted in the campground. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Good afternoon, sir. Please fill it up. 2. Can I give you a ride to the station? Thanks for offering. 3. Do you know how much it is? Let me guess. Probably $500. 4. Let me introduce myself. I'm Jane. Nice to meet you. 5. May I ask why you're calling? I want to discuss the schedule. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. So, how was your class? It was okay. It's the first time I've taught Korean students. What was your impression of them? They didn't seem to be interested in my class. Oh, really? What makes you think so? Well, they avoided my eye contact. What do you mean? Whenever I looked at them, they looked away or looked at the floor. Oh, I think you misunderstand them. Asian people usually give less eye contact than Western people. Oh, I see. But I feel very strange when they do this. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Did you call Mr. Jin? Yes, he's arriving today. Did you check his flight schedule? Yes, his flight is due to arrive at 9 a.m. in the morning. 
Good. Are you going to meet him? Yes, I am. I need to talk to him about the contract. What time should I have the meeting? Well, Mr. Jin will need some time to change his clothes at the hotel. How long will it take for him to get here from the hotel? 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What have you been up to these days? I'm busy preparing for the presentation at the seminar. Are you ready for it now? Not quite, and it is only two days away. How do you feel about it? I feel very nervous because so many people will come. Oh, so you are going to give a talk at this international seminar? Yeah, it's the first time I've done something like that. And you'll have to speak in English? Yeah, I'm worried about that too. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 경찰관이 셀리에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Sally is driving her brother to the airport. Her brother is very late for his flight, and he is afraid that he might miss it. The next flight is not until tomorrow evening. Sally starts to drive faster and faster, and she begins to ignore the speed limit. She sees an intersection up ahead, and the lights change to red. There are no other cars around, and no one is crossing the street. Sally continues driving through the red light. All of a sudden, a police car appears behind her and motions for her to pull over. What will the police officer most likely say to Sally? 대화를 듣고 남자가 사려고 하는 탁자를 고르시오. I'm looking for a nice table. What about this one with drawers? Well, drawers, that's no good. I want it for the living room. Okay. How about this round table? I'd prefer a rectangular top. Okay. What about this fancy design? Well, I'm not sure. I'd like a simple design. Ah. Well, maybe this rectangular one will suit your taste. Actually, I don't like glass tops. You can see the guest legs under the table. Then maybe you'd like this table. Look at the round balls at the top of the legs. That's perfect. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Helen Robinson arrived, Dr. Bear. Is she here already? A half an hour early? She is. Would you like me to call her in? Yes. Oh, no. Wait a minute. No problem. I just want to look over her chart for a moment first. How long would that be for today? She just needs a cleaning and x-rays. So, a half hour will be enough, right? Yes, I think I have time to see one more patient before lunch. 대화를 듣고 현재의 시각을 고르시오. Has anyone seen Hans? He was here at 12.30. Why are you looking for him? He's scheduled to be here at 1 for the meeting. But I haven't seen him since then. It's already 10 past 1. How long will the meeting take? It will probably take 2 hours. I hope he hasn't forgotten the appointment. Why don't you wait for another 10 minutes? 대화를 듣고 남자가 하려 가는 것을 고르시오. How are you? Not very well. What's the matter? I think I may have deleted my file by mistake. Oh, poor boy. Can you help me? I don't know much about that computer program. Can you think of anyone who can be of help? Frank could probably handle the problem. He's a computer genius. Thanks. I'll give him a call. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. Welcome, Mr. Simmons. Thank you for meeting me here at the airport. No problem. How was your trip? It was quite pleasant, but a little bumpy. Oh, is that so? The flight was a bit uncomfortable, wasn't it? Kind of, so I didn't sleep very well. Sorry to hear that. I'll have my assistant take you to your hotel at once. Oh, thank you. Is it far? No. It takes about 15 minutes from here. Good. I'll take some rest and we'll get down to work later in the office. 다음을 듣고 누가 누구에게 말하고 있는지 고르시오. Welcome to the Physics 101. For most of you, this course is necessary for your major. I want to begin by giving an explanation on the basic requirements that must be completed to pass the course. There'll be two exams, a midterm and a final. The midterm exam is worth 30% of the final grade, and the final is worth 30%. 
Each exam consists of multiple choice and essay questions, and you are responsible for writing one research paper, whose topic is up to you. That is worth the remaining 40%. 대화를 듣고 광고 중에서 사실과 다른 부분을 찾으시오. Aren't you coming with us for lunch? Where are you going this time? To Antonio's. I love the lunch special there. Me too. A meatball spaghetti with free salad and drink is excellent. That's right. That's why it's been in business for more than 10 years. Right. Shall I reserve a table? That'd be nice. It's very crowded. The number is 453-3285. Can I pay by credit card? Sure. Some restaurants don't, though. 대화를 듣고 남자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello. May I speak with Jessica? Speaking. I'm sure you're James. What's up? Hi. Do you know anyone who speaks Chinese well? Well, let me see. Why do you want to know that? We have an important client from China. Carol is quite fluent. She spent 10 years in mainland China. Really? She'd be perfect then. Do you want me to talk with her? I'll ask her myself when I see her after the meeting. 대화를 듣고 여자가 부산에 갔던 이유로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What's your plan for tomorrow? I'm going to Busan. Really? I was just out there last month, trying to find locations for a new store. Oh, that's right. You're opening a new branch store there soon, aren't you? Yes. I found some good places. Good. I'll be there for a couple of days. So, are you there on a vacation? Vacation? You must be kidding. On a business trip again? Unfortunately, yes. I'll meet some clients. 대화를 듣고 남자의 심장을 묘사한 것으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What's the plan for tonight? Well, I'm really looking forward to going out somewhere. That sounds like a good idea. How about going to see the movie Vanilla Sky? That sure is better than spending another boring night at home. I love the movies. Don't speak too soon. This movie might be totally confusing. Maybe, but I can't stand another night at home. But can you stand three hours of a boring movie? I don't care. It's just great to get out. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자에게 제안한 것을 고르시오. It seems you're not feeling very well. Yeah, I think my cold is getting much worse. Sorry to hear that. I feel awful. My throat is really sore and I'm running a high fever. Oh, your cough sounds terrible. And I cough so much at night that I can't sleep. Why don't you go home and get some sleep? But I know how busy it'll be today. Don't worry. Just leave early and take some rest at home. I'll cover for you. Thank you for your kindness. 다음을 듣고 여자가 주장하는 것으로 일치하는 것을 고르시오. Surprisingly, according to a survey, 67% of female students at high school feel that they are overweight and feel bad about their overall appearance. I think the mass media are responsible for this. The media show unrealistic body images. Magazines and TV show images of very skinny supermodels, which teenagers regard as beautiful or fashionable. And thus, many teenagers are unnecessarily on a diet because they want to look like skinny supermodels. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Could you turn down the TV, please? Sure. I didn't know that it's so loud. 2. What's the matter, officer? You have a flat tire. 3. Did you find the movie interesting? I think it's very fantastic. 4. May I help you? No, thanks. I'm just looking around. 5. Do you play tennis every weekend? Yes, it's a great exercise. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. We're going out later. Oh, what are you going to do? We're thinking of going to dinner. What kind of restaurant do you have in mind? I'm not sure. Maybe Italian. Oh, I love Italian food. Why don't you come with us? Oh, I'd really like to, but I'm on a diet. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 
가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Good morning, sir. Can I help you? It's my wife's birthday. So, do you want to buy a gift for her? Yes, I need something nice. How about this perfume? It smells really nice. Oh, but my wife is allergic to perfume. Oh, then how about this box of chocolates? No, that's no good. My wife started jogging. In that case, why not get her some sportswear? That's a nice idea. Can you suggest something suitable? Yes. These are free-sized jogging pants. This style's very popular right now. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Oh my god. This copy machine has broken down again. Yeah, but the repairman will be here in an hour. Oh dear. I have to go to class right now. That's a big problem. What can I do? My lesson is based on these handouts. Seeing as you're in such a hurry, I will probably help you. There are two red lights on. What does it mean? There's a paper jam. Can you handle the problem? I think so. Ah, here you go. The machine is working now. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 제니스가 손님에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Janice is working at her part-time job in a supermarket. Some very young-looking customers come to the sales counter. They have many things in their shopping cart. Janice is processing all the items when she sees that one of them happens to be an alcoholic drink. These customers look under the age of 18, but Janice cannot be sure of their age. Janice knows it's against the law to sell alcohol to teenagers. In this situation, what should Janice ask them? 대화를 듣고 남자가 찾고 있는 아이를 고르시오. Hello, what brings you here? Hi, I'm with my kid. Oh, which one? The one flying a kite? No, one of those playing nearby. Then the one sliding down with his hands in the air? No, my child doesn't like playing on the slide. One of the children sitting on the swing? No, my child is standing on the swing. Oh, I see him now. It looks like he is having fun. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Have you had a chance to talk with Sophia? Sophia? Oh, you mean the student from Italy? Yes. She was in my office some days ago. Is there any problem with her? Um, I believe she's having a hard time adjusting here. Probably right. She is the only one who hasn't turned in the term paper yet. I think she is kind of homesick for Italy. She might need some counseling. Why don't you let her talk to a campus advisor? That's a good idea. 대화를 듣고 강의에 참석한 사람들의 수를 고르시오. The lecture is likely to be successful. Yes, the lecture room is quite crowded. There are no empty chairs left in here. Did you think so many people would come? No, we were expecting only 80. But we had a hundred chairs ready, and they're all taken already. I hope even more people will be here at the next lecture. How many chairs will we need for next week's lecture? It looks like we'll have to get 150 chairs for it. That will be better. 대화를 듣고 남자가 가장 먼저 해야 할 일을 고르시오. We're on our way to a coffee shop. Going to the one next to the department store? Yes. Do you want to join us? I'd like to, but I have to meet my sister. Will it take long? No, we'll be over as soon as she gets here. Why is she coming? To drop off my purse. I forgot to bring it this morning. Okay. We'll head out now and see you there later. Got it. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. So, what did you think of the film? Wow, I lost track of time during the showing. Same here. I thought it was great. What's your favorite part? The shots with the mountains at sunset were breathtaking. I loved the scene at the zoo. I liked it too, but it was too long for me. Yeah, we need to stretch our legs. How about getting some popcorn? No, let's get out of here and go to a cafe. 다음에 듣고 남자가 무엇을 하고 있는지 고르시오. Welcome back to the show. Today we have three new contestants and the winner of the last show. Can the winner hold on to his title? You'll have to watch and see. 
let me briefly explain how the game is played. We have four categories, people, events, cities, and year. The contestants will select a category and will try to answer the given questions correctly. The contestant that has the most correct answers will be the winner. Good luck! 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 이용하려는 교통 수단을 고르시오. What beautiful scenery! Yeah, look at the crystal blue lake and the mountains around it. You know, that's why it's named Heavenly Valley. How about riding a bicycle along the shore? I don't think it's a good idea. How about taking the passenger ferry across the lake? Good idea. Let's check the schedule. The last one this evening sails at 7.30. Okay, then let's buy the 7.30 ticket. 다음을 듣고 남자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, this is Greg calling. I'm calling to ask you a favor. I'm working on a new research paper these days. My research topic is about modern logics. I need lots of good reference books. I remember you had a good book on this topic. So I'm calling to ask if you can lend me the book. I would like to borrow it for two weeks. If you can lend it to me, please bring it with you. I can get it from you when I meet you at lunch. Thank you. Bye. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자에게 주의를 준 이유로 옳은 것을 고르시오. I'm home, honey. Be careful. This place is a mess. What happened? I accidentally dropped a glass bottle here and the broken pieces of bottle are all over the place. Hold on, and I'll get a broom so we can sweep it up. I've got the broom already. Could you find a dustpan? Well, we don't have one. I'll vacuum the floor. That would be better. Okay. I'll get the vacuum right away. 대화를 듣고 남자의 심정을 묘사한 것으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. So, Sam, today's the day. Yeah, today I take my entrance examination. Have you been studying hard for it? You bet I have. I've been studying hard for a year now. Are you happy about taking the exam today? I wouldn't say I'm happy, but I do feel well prepared. Oh, really? Good to hear that. I think I'm going to do very well. Good luck, then. I'm glad you're not feeling nervous. 대화를 듣고 남자가 만나려고 하는 사람을 고르시오. Excuse me, can I come in? I'm sorry. Only doctors and medical staff are allowed in the testing center. Actually, I'm trying to find the doctor, Ms. Bartle. I'm her assistant. May I ask what it is about? I need to tell her that the new patients are waiting for her in the office. She's going over some test results now. She probably has her cellular phone with her, and here's the number. Okay. Wait a moment, and I'll give her a call. 다음을 듣고 효율적으로 일을 하기 위한 여자의 증거로 일치하는 것을 고르시오. Good morning. Today we are going to give you some advice on how to work smarter. In order to get your work done more quickly and efficiently, it is a good idea to make a list of things to do. Next, you should decide on how important the work is, and then put your work into three categories. First on your list should be the work that needs to be done urgently. Then you should have a list of important work. Lastly, you should list the work that can be done at a later time. This will help you save time and work better. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Can I help you? Yes, please. I'm looking for a shampoo. 2. How do you like your hair done? I want to have it cut. 3. What would you like to have? I want a glass of orange juice. 4. I hate the new hairdresser. Well, you look younger in the new style. 5. Can I try this gown on? Certainly. The mirror is over there in the corner. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Are we all set for now? Hold on. I'll be ready in 20 minutes. The show will start soon. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. But it will take us 30 minutes to get there. No, it won't take that long. You're still in the shower? Hurry up! Okay, I'm just washing my hair. Forget about your hair. It's time to go. 
대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Here is your meal, ma'am. Thank you. Oh, this looks like chicken. Yes, ma'am. This is our house special. But I ordered steak. Oh, let me check your order. Let me see. Oh, you marked the wrong item. Oh, I'm afraid there was a mix-up of orders. So, would you exchange it for a steak? 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Where shall we go tonight? I don't know. It's raining again. We've had rainy weekends for three weeks now. Yeah, it makes it difficult to go out. Why don't we go to the movies? There's no interesting movies showing. Why don't we go to a restaurant? Why don't we just stay home? That's a good idea. We could watch a video and I could cook some spaghetti. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 마지막에 이어질 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. The temperature around the world is getting warmer and warmer. This global warming is due to the pollution, which is mostly caused by toxic gas produced from automobiles. Unfortunately, more and more people are getting cars, and the problem will only get worse. If we can find another source of energy that automobiles can operate on, perhaps we can solve this problem. 대화를 듣고 지도에서 남자가 찾아가고 있는 것을 고르시오. Excuse me, I'd like directions to go to the amusement park. Oh, it's on Highway 13. How can I take it from here? First, take Highway 80 north and you'll meet the Highway 13. Then what do I do? Go east or west? You go east on Highway 13 for 40 kilometers. 40 kilometers east. The road is good there, and that won't take you very long at all. That's very nice. Thank you. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. I've been hearing some strange noises under the hood for the past two weeks. What do you think is wrong with my car? Let me see. Well, actually, quite a lot. Your radiator is leaking. Your fuel pump is broken. I need the car for my trip next week. How long will the repair take? It needs a major repair, probably a week. It could take longer. How much will all of this cost? Wait a minute. That would be $280. I have a discount coupon for work. Good. We accept coupons. 대화를 듣고 프로페서 강이 강연을 하기로 한 때를 고르시오. Did you contact Professor Kang? Yes. We talked about the speaker's series. So, did she let you know when she will be available? She can't come in March or April. Then do we have to put her section in next semester? Not necessarily. What did she say? She said she'd be available in May or June. May is scheduled already, so it will have to be June. No problem. 대화를 듣고 여자가 하려 가는 일을 고르시오. Um, today is the 2nd of July. Do you know what that means? Does it matter what day it is? You know it's Brenda's birthday. That's right. I almost forgot about it. What can we do to celebrate? Well, we don't have time to buy a gift. Then how about a lunch together? I'm not available, though. Perhaps we could buy her a bouquet of flowers. All right, but I don't see any good florists around here. Well, I have the phone number for one. I'll give a call and have it delivered. 대화를 듣고 여자에 대한 설명으로 옳은 것을 고르시오. What have you been doing these days? I've been starting on a new project. How about yourself? Pretty well. Uh, I thought I saw you at the savings bank last Sunday. No, it couldn't have been me. I believe it was you. Actually, I was out of town for a week, and I got back home on Monday. Well, someone out there looks just like you. Yes, it happens sometimes. So, where have you been? I've been on a vacation to Hawaii with my family. 다음을 듣고 남자가 무엇에 대해 설명하는지 고르시오. Let me show all of you how the new copy machine works. It's really easy to use. First of all, just make sure there is paper in the tray. You then put the original document on the glass face down and put the lid down. Enter the number of copies you want to make and then press the start button. Quite simple, really. 
I think you'll be happy with how fast this machine works. You can also make color copies as well as black and white. Any questions? 대화를 듣고 여자가 타겟을 비행기를 고르시오. Excuse me, I can't see the departure gate for my flight. Where are you going to? San Francisco. My ticket says the gate is 23, but it's closed. I'm sorry, the plane had already left. Oh, no! I should have come earlier. When is the next flight? We have one leaving at 1.30 this afternoon. Now I'm in trouble. I have an important meeting there at 3. If so, you can take a flight that has a stopover in Chicago. When will it be in San Francisco? It's scheduled to be there at 1.30. That's good. So what's the departure gate? Go to gate 23. Hurry up, it's boarding now. 다음을 듣고 여자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, this is Angela Wang, the manager of international service at Modern Furniture Production. I'm calling to inform you that we are unable to deliver your furniture on time. Your leather sofa will take longer to be ready. So all of your orders will be sent out two weeks later than originally scheduled. You can have the delivery by the end of the month. I'd like to apologize for the delay. Please call me if you have any questions at 510-745-1110. 대화를 듣고 여자가 화가 난 이유로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma'am. I have an appointment with Dr. Herring at 2. You must be Ms. Chung. That's right. Is the doctor in the office? I'm sorry, he's not available today. He'll be back tomorrow. That's too bad. Why wasn't I informed? I tried to contact you yesterday, but couldn't. I have to get another appointment then. Sure. Would you like to reschedule it? Okay. I'll drop by at 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. 대화를 듣고 여자의 심장을 묘사한 것으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Jack. Can you spare me some time? Sure. I'm free this afternoon. What can I do for you? Would you check my pronunciation? No problem. You're competing in the English-speaking contest, aren't you? Yes. I passed the first round, but there seem to be some really good speakers in the second round. So when is the contest? Tomorrow morning. And I don't feel I am ready for it. You'll be okay, but you need to relax. But I can't. I don't want to make any mistakes. Okay, run over it and I'll help you. 대화를 듣고 이번 토요일에 남자가 해야 할 일을 고르시오. I wonder if you're still looking for a job. Well, I almost got a job at an advertising agency. Almost? What do you mean? I did very well on my interview and I got selected as one of the final four candidates. That's great! Yeah, but there's one thing left before the final interview. What is that? First, I have to pass a written test this Saturday. So you'd better start studying. 다음을 듣고, 여자가 인간 복제에 대해 주장하는 것으로 일치하는 것을 고르시오. Today, so much progress has been made in genetic engineering that human cloning is possible. And scientists are able to clone the same person from the DNA of any human being. Some say human cloning would not be harmful because it can help treat illnesses such as cancer. However, for me, it's terrifying to imagine seeing a person with my face and voice walking around here and there. We will lose our uniqueness. I don't want to think of the terrifying human sameness by cloning. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Wow, you've caught a big fish. Yeah, let's have it for dinner. 2. How about going to the new seafood restaurant? Okay, let's check it out. 3. Can I try this on? Certainly. The fitting room is over there. 4. Are we done with our shopping? We just need to buy some fish. 5. Why aren't you coming with us? I have to finish my work. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Do you have any plans for tomorrow? Can you join us for dinner? I'd love to. What is the occasion? We have professors visiting from New York University. I see. 
Are they the same people who visited here before? No, they are different people. What time is the dinner? The reservation is made for 7.30, but I'll see you in the lobby at 7. Great. I'll see you then. Don't be late like last time. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. How's it going? Oh, not very well. What's the matter? Well, clients are complaining because I haven't replied to their emails. So why didn't you respond to them? You know there's a big problem right now with my computer. Did it break down again? No, there's a really bad virus going around. Why don't you download the vaccine? Where can I get it? 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What's this? You left the door unlocked again? Oh, really? I am sure I locked it. Well, who else could have done it? I guess it must have been me, then. Don't you worry about thieves coming into our home? Calm down. Nothing's happened. Not this time, but you never know when something bad will happen. All right. We're safe now, aren't we? You should be more aware of safety next time. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 제니퍼가 사람들에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Jennifer is in a very crowded subway. She is daydreaming when suddenly she looks up and realizes that she has reached her destination. She is hurrying for a meeting because she can't be late. She is stuck in the middle of the car and there are many people between her and the doors. She is afraid she won't be able to get to the doors before they close. In this situation, what will Jennifer most likely say to people? 배우를 듣고 남자가 찾고 있는 사람을 고르시오. I'm looking for a trainer. One of them is in the gym. Who are you talking about? Is it the one wiping sweat from her brow? No, that's our customer. Then you mean the one lifting weights? No, you see the one on the running machine? Well, there are three of them. The one with long hair? No, the trainer is not a lady. Then the guy on the second machine? No, you see the guy wearing a shirt with a rabbit on it? Now I got it. 대화를 듣고 남자가 원하는 것을 고르시오. Good afternoon. May I help you? Do you have a copy of Harry Potter by Joan Rowling? Sorry. We sold out all of our copies when it topped the bestseller list. Well, do you have any of her other books? Sure we do. Do you see the yellow section over there? Books are alphabetically arranged by the name of writers. Thank you. My pleasure. Ah, we also have audiobooks available. Audiobooks? They are in the same section. 대화를 듣고 남자의 비행기가 출발하는 시각을 고르시오. When are you leaving for your vacation? I'm leaving for Hawaii tomorrow night. How long will you stay there? For five days. Great. What time is your flight? It's going to depart at eight in the evening. But you'll have to get to the airport much earlier. Yeah, I'll get there two hours before the departure time. Right. You should be there by 6.30 at the latest. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. I'd like a one-way ticket to Washington, please. Certainly. It's leaving soon, so you'll have to hurry to the platform. Oh, dear. There's no time to get a cup of coffee. No problem. You can get one in the dining car. Which platform is it? It's platform 8. Please hurry. Oh, dear. I can't see the sign. Where do I go? The sign is over there, above the vending machine. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 고르시오. Tell me about your present job, Mr. Norman. I work in the overseas student service at a college. I see. How long have you been at this job? For just over a year, since last March. It sounds like an interesting job. Why do you want to leave? It's interesting, but I'd like a job that involves traveling. That's why I'm applying for your agency. Good. Do you speak any foreign language? Yes, I do. I speak Spanish, French, and a little Japanese. 다음을 듣고 남자가 무엇을 하고 있는지 고르시오. We are here tonight to bid farewell to one of our most valuable employees, Ted Norris. After 30 years of service at our company, to our regret, Ted Norris is leaving us. 
Now he is hoping to return to his hometown and start his own business. He has been an essential part of our company, leading us to the top at the market. All right, everyone, let's give a warm welcome to Mr. Ted Norris. 다음에 듣고 언급된 동작을 순서대로 옳게 나열한 것을 고르시오. Now I'm going to show you how to loosen those tight shoulders after a hard day at work. Okay, first put your right arm out. Your left arm should be relaxed down. Count to 20. Next, put your left hand on your hip, leaving your right arm straight out in the air. Turn your head and look over your left shoulder. Lastly, hold your hands tightly behind your back and try to make both arms straight in the air. This can be easily done in your office or at home in just five minutes. 배우를 듣고 남자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, how may I help you? I'm afraid I left my cellular phone in the subway. Okay, can you tell me what it looks like? It is a creamy white one. We have several of them here. Hold on, I'll just dial my number. Good idea. Then I'll see which one rings. Okay, here it goes. Are you calling from 227-7722? That's mine. I'll drop by this afternoon to get it. Please come to the Lost and Found office. We'll have it ready. 대화를 듣고 여자가 약속 시간에 오지 못한 이유를 고르시오. Good morning. You missed your 8 o'clock appointment. I'm sorry. You're usually on time. Is anything wrong? My babysitter called this morning and told me that she couldn't come. So did you find someone else? Fortunately, my mom is taking care of my kids. Good. How was the meeting going? We discussed very important matters. Let's talk about it over lunch. 대화를 듣고 여자의 심장을 묘사한 것을 고르시오. So, got any news? Yeah, my youngest sister is coming to live with us when she starts college next year. Is that good news? Of course. I haven't seen my sister for a long time. Well, I always fight with my sister. My sister is a nice girl. Oh, then that'll be nice for you. Yes, we're really looking forward to having her around. 배우를 듣고 두 사람이 바로 다음에 하려 가는 것을 고르시오. Look at the sky. Finally, the sun is shining after two weeks of rainy days. Yeah, it really feels good. So, what's your plan for today? I'm going for a bike ride all day. I'll come with you. You should take a warm jacket and a hat. Okay, are we leaving now? No, before we go out, we need to have a big breakfast. Right, we should not miss any meal. 다음을 듣고 무엇에 관한 것인지를 고르시오. Listen up, everyone. We'll go over the safety rules this time before we go on our trip down to the river. Your life jacket must be on the entire time. Do not take it off at any time. Sometimes it can come off because of the water, so check on it frequently. Stay seated the whole time because if you stand up, the boat can turn upside down. If your boat is overturned, stay calm and the guide will help you. By keeping these rules, you can prevent unnecessary accidents or injury. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Is there anything I can do for you? Yes, I'd like to buy a shirt for my brother. 2. Are you being waited on, sir? No. Can I see the menu, please? 3. What seems to be the problem? My car won't start. 4. Give me 10 stamps and envelopes. That'll be 850. 5. How are you feeling today? I feel terrible. I should stay in bed. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, is that Collins? Yeah, who's calling? It's me, Jennifer. Oh, Jennifer, long time no see. Yes, it's been two years since I last spoke with you. Yeah, that must have been at Peter's wedding. That's right. I'm coming back to London next week for a seminar. Oh, really? That's great. I really want to see you. I'll look you up when I arrive. 대화를 듣고 
남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. I haven't seen you before. I'm Anna Lee. I'm a foreign student. Where are you from? I'm from Korea. I came here to study English literature. I'm from Israel. I came to study engineering. So, how is it going? It's not been easy, but this is just the beginning, so maybe it will get easier. Yeah. English literature for foreign students is not a game either. So, how's everything else going? So far, so good, except for the coursework. Did you find somewhere to stay? 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Oh, you look very happy today. Yeah, I met a really nice guy yesterday. So, tell me about it. Well, I started a new class, and a gorgeous guy sat next to me. Great. Did he say anything to you? He just asked if he could borrow my pen. Do you think he is interested in you as well? Well, I'm not sure. Did anything else happen? Not really, but I'm starting to feel crazy about him. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 Mrs. Monica가 Mrs. Jones에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mrs. Jones has two young children who now attend elementary school. They have a lot of old books which are too easy for them now. Mrs. Monica, her neighbor, has a five-year-old child. Mrs. Jones knows the child loves reading books, so she offers many of her son's old books to Mrs. Monica. Given the suggestion, how will Mrs. Monica most likely reply? 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 사료 가는 시계를 고르시오. Look at these table clocks. Which one should we get for my living room? Well, what about this one? Oh, I don't like the square shape. It's too simple. Then how about this one with the round shape? Well, the base is too wide. It is too big for our small table. There's another round shape. Well, but it's a bit too long. And I think this round shape is too common. You see it everywhere. Oh, let me think. What about this one, then? Hmm, it has too many sides. Then maybe you'd like this triangular shape. It's quite unique. Yeah, that's great. It is somewhat different. Okay, let's get it. 대화를 듣고 여자가 원하는 것을 고르시오. As you see, most companies have their own home pages these days. Right. So we want you to make a website for our company. Okay. What do you want it to look like? Do you have any samples that I can choose from? Sure. There's a wide range of options from basic to high level. How long and how much money would you need to do that? Well, it depends on your selection. Let's see. This website looks great. Yes, it does. It's among the best ones that we've made. I want our home pages to look like this. 대화를 듣고 여자가 현상하려는 사진의 개수를 고르시오. These are the pictures from our trip. Oh, I haven't seen them. Let me take a look. Are these the group pictures? Yes. I've chosen the best four group shots among all those pictures. How many people were on the trip? Twelve people traveled together. And I'd like to send a copy of their group pictures to each of the 12 people. Let's see which is the best picture of all these four shots. How about this one? I think it's the best, and I'll order a dozen prints. I agree. All the people look great in it. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화를 장수를 고르시오. I need a watch I can wear in the swimming pool. We have many suitable watches. I'm interested in this model. Can I see it? Sure. Do you dive as well? Yes, so I need a good one. Would you like to see something from the display case? Yes, if you don't mind. The watch in the front. It's a Swiss design, waterproof and shockproof. One of our finest pieces. Can I try it on? Sure. This one is really popular with the ladies. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 고르시오. Here's your prescription for your flu. Thank you. You are supposed to take one tablet once a day and take one at bedtime. I see. One tablet two times a day. That's right. Is it for three days? Yes, but you can stop taking medication if you feel better. One more thing. You might feel tired or sleepy after taking this medication.
Oh, really? Don't worry too much. Those are common side effects. I understand. I hope it works. Thank you very much. 다음을 듣고 남자가 무엇을 하고 있는지 고르시오. I'm pleased you all could make it tonight. After many years of hard work, commitment, and successful results at the company, Ms. Marilyn Chambers has been promoted to president. Ms. Chambers began working here as a sales position 10 years ago and became a marketing manager within two years. She quickly advanced to higher positions and came a long way to be the leader of our company. Now let's give a warm welcome to our new president, Ms. Chambers. 대화를 듣고 아래표에서 잘못된 부분을 고르시오. What's the plan for this weekend? Well, I have tickets to a soccer game. Soccer? Did the season already start? It'll start this Saturday on March 4th. Really? I didn't know that. Isn't it great to see the first game of the season? It is. It will also have a special event. Right. The game starts at 8, so I'll pick you up at 7. Thank you. How much is the ticket? It's just eight dollars. 대화를 듣고 여자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, how may I help you? This is Paula Jones. Oh, hi, Ms. Jones. You have a reservation for Thursday night. Right, but can I change the time? Of course. How would you like it now? I want to move up the time from 7 to 6. Let me check the schedule. Okay, I can do that, ma'am. Good. I'll come at 6 instead of 7. Okay. Is there anything else? No, that's all. Thank you. 대화를 듣고 남자가 아파트를 계약하지 않은 이유를 고르시오. I'm looking for a two-bedroom apartment. We have a good one near the subway station. How much is the rent? It's $700, and the building is new. It's very reasonable, and it's close to my office. But I must tell you, this apartment is on the fourth floor. What's wrong with that? There's no elevator. I can't walk up all those stairs every day. Do you have anything on the ground floor? No, not at this time. 대화를 듣고 여자의 심장을 묘사한 것을 고르시오. What's the matter? I should have been more careful. What do you mean? I'm afraid my computer has a problem with its hard disk, and I forgot to back up my work. Can you do it again? No way. I spent three days working on this report, and it must be finished soon. Oh, poor girl. Do you know how to recover it? No, I've been trying to, but I don't know enough about computers. Oh, and it's Sunday, so the computer technicians must be off from work today. Can't anybody help me? I'm really in trouble now. 대화를 듣고 남자가 사려 가는 것을 고르시오. How is your new work going? I'm very happy with it, thank you. So how do you go to work? I take the bus, but I want to borrow some money and buy a motorcycle. Well, I think you should wait and buy a car. You know I don't want a car. But I saw a show on TV about accidents last night. Well, I will never be able to save enough for a car. I know, but I just think the motorcycles aren't safe, don't you? 다음을 듣고 디스가 무엇인지를 고르시오. This is one of the most durable materials because it doesn't break easily. This is widely used in industry. It is not as strong as steel, but it's much lighter. So we often see that many toys and boxes are made of this. However, this causes pollution because this is not decomposed. Once it is buried underground, it lasts forever and it produces very toxic pollutant, dioxin, into the air when it is burned. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. What do you have in mind? I'm looking for a dining table. 2. May I use the telephone? Sure. Go ahead. 3. Is this seat taken? Yes. I'm waiting for a friend. 4. Wow, this cake looks good. Come over and help yourself. Five. I'd like to reserve the table for tonight. Okay. At what time, please? 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What shall we do this weekend? 
We've lived here for six months, but we've never seen a concert. Yes, and we live so close to Broadway. Why don't we go and see one tomorrow? Oh, sorry. I'm busy tomorrow. All right. How about Sunday? Yeah, that'll be fine with me. Shall we see the musical Cats? I've seen it before when I was in London. How about going to a jazz concert rather than a musical? 배우를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Mary. How are things? Oh, you know. Every day's a bit the same. You don't sound too cheerful. Well, I thought I'd met a nice guy. Really? But you don't seem to get along well. Well, it didn't work out between us. Oh, what was the problem? We didn't have enough in common. Oh, well, you'll meet a nice guy sooner or later. I hope so. But they're not easy to find. 배워를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, you're new in Korea, right? Yes, I just got here from Canada last week. Oh, I'm also from Canada. Great. Maybe you can give me some good tips. Sure. What would you like to know? Can you recommend a good dish to try? Yes. How about bibimbap? What's that? It's a really tasty dish with lots of vegetables. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 다니엘이 식당 점원에게 물어볼 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Daniel is with his friends at a crowded restaurant. Daniel likes this restaurant because they serve the best cheesecake in town. Cheesecake is his favorite dessert, and he is really looking forward to having some. However, Daniel and his friends have only one hour for lunch. Then they must return to work. So Daniel's wondering if they should wait or find another place to eat. In this situation, what would Daniel most probably ask the waiter? 배우를 듣고 남자가 찾고 있는 사람을 고르시오. A birthday party picture? Yes. Can you guess which one is my daughter? Is she wearing a ribbon on her hair? No, she's wearing a party hat. Party hat? Is she blowing a balloon? No, she doesn't have a balloon. Is she standing up? Yes. Can you see her now? She's blowing out the birthday candles? You've got it. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 고르시오. Hi, this is Jim Collins, and I'd like to make an appointment with Dr. Lee. Do you have any problem, or is it just for a regular checkup? These days I can't see things very well. I think my eyes are getting weak. Okay, let me check the schedule. Can you come on the 15th? The 15th next Monday? I have an important meeting in the morning. Well then, could you make it at 1.30? I can't get out of my office until after 3 o'clock. Then how about 3.30? All right. 대화를 듣고 여자가 공연장 좌석 값으로 지불해야 할 액수를 고르시오. Can I buy the tickets for tonight's opera? Yes, we have about 20 seats available now. Good. How much is the ticket for the show? Well, it depends on where you are seated. Just tell me and I'll think about it. $24 for center seats and $14 for balcony and aisle seats. Fine. I'd like two in the balcony, please. Do you want to pay with credit card? No, I'll pay by cash. Here's $30. Okay, here's your change. $2. 대화를 듣고 남자가 사려는 선물을 고르시오. Tomorrow is our wedding anniversary. Oh, is it? How long have you been married? Actually, it's been 10 years. Wow, you should be thinking about something special for your wife. So what do you think I should get my wife? I was thinking about either a ring or a romantic weekend away. Well, I think women love diamonds. Ah, good idea. I saw her looking at a diamond necklace at the department store the other day. Really? Then a diamond necklace would be a perfect choice. Okay, I should go take a look at it today at lunch. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. May I see your ticket, please? I'm sorry, I can't seem to find it. Okay, I'll give you some more time and I'll come back when I finish checking the other passengers in this car. What if I've lost it? Well, I'm afraid I'll have to ask you to pay for another one. Oh, that would be a problem. 
or you'll have to get off at the next station. I'll have another look for it. 다음에 듣고 남자가 무엇을 설명하고 있는지 고르시오. Good afternoon, everyone. Today we'll learn the basics of handling an emergency case of a heart attack. The important thing is to make the patient breathe again. The first action you should take is to lay the patient down and press down on their chest with your hands many times. Next, you should close the airways of the nose and blow air into the patient's mouth. Would you please sit around me and I will show you how to do that. 대화를 듣고 여자가 체중을 줄이려는 방법을 고르시오. I'm afraid you're gaining weight these days. Well, I've decided I'm overweight and I want to lose some weight. Perhaps you could go on a diet. Well, you know, I hate dieting. Or you could try going to a sports club with me if you want. No, thanks. I don't like wasting time on an exercise bike or lifting weights. Then what are you planning to do? I want to start jogging. Sounds good, but you should be careful. If you run too fast, you could have severe pains in your legs. Okay, I'll try to run for at least 20 minutes every day. 다음에 듣고 여자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, this message is for Joe Sinclair in charge of hiring. My name is Michelle Cohen, and I'm calling about the job opening for a salesperson in your sportswear clothing section. I am very interested in this position and would appreciate it if you sent me an application. My address is 521 Pildong Chongrogu, Seoul. Once again, I'm looking forward to receiving an application for the sales position. Thanks very much. 대화를 듣고 여자가 걱정하는 이유를 고르시오. Hi, how's it going, Mary? Not very well. What's up? You look very worried. Have you seen my dog? No, what happened to him? He's been missing for the last two days. I'm sorry to hear that. I'll ask my kids when I get home. Thanks, I'm really concerned. 대화를 듣고 남자의 심장을 묘사한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Jeff. What's the matter? What's the matter? I've been waiting in the study room for one hour, but no one showed up. Oh, didn't you know? Know what? The meeting was called off. Why wasn't I told about that? Didn't Jane tell you? She said she'd call you. Well, I didn't get any messages. That's too bad. Please calm down. That's the last time I go to your study group. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자에게 제안한 것을 고르시오. You are not driving today, are you? I was involved in a car accident. So did your car get a lot of damage? Unfortunately, yes. My mechanic says it needs a major repair. How long will it take to be repaired? It would take a week at least. Why don't you use my car until your car is fixed? Don't you need it? No, I'm going to be out of town for business all week. That's very kind of you. 다음에 듣고 누가 누구에게 말하고 있는지 고르시오. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you are having a pleasant flight. We have about two more hours to go before we arrive in John F. Kennedy Airport. We will be serving your meal shortly. We also serve alcoholic as well as a variety of non-alcoholic beverages. For alcoholic beverages, please show the attendants your photo identification. Enjoy your meal, and we hope you enjoy the rest of the trip. Thank you. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Will you take a train? No, I'll drive there. 2. Would you like to use my umbrella? Oh, thanks a lot. 3. Should I take a warm jacket? Not necessarily. 4. Is there any message for me? Your daughter called. 5. Why don't you try some more? No, thanks. I'm full. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi. How's your work going? Oh, I'm so busy right now. Oh, yeah? I guess it's near the end of the semester. That's right. So I have a lot of test papers to make for students. Oh, that doesn't sound like fun. No, but I don't mind because the vacation will soon come. Do you enjoy working with young students? Usually. Sometimes they can be a little difficult, though. I think being a teacher is hard these days, 
especially when the students don't show any respect. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. I'm looking for a good English textbook. Is it for a college student? Yes. I need a beginner's level conversation book. Okay, we have several books on this shelf. Why don't you take a look? Thank you. This one looks good. Yes, that's a very popular one. How much is it with my membership card? You get 10% off. Can I get an additional discount if I place a large order? 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. When are your friends coming? They'll be here at 6 p.m. Okay, so I'll have to clean the house inside and out and prepare the dinner. I know, but don't worry. I'll help you. Yes, please help. You know I'm not feeling very well. You are the best wife in the world. Stop kidding around and get on with the work. Okay, what shall I do for you? Would you throw away the garbage? 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 조가 친구들에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Joe is having a housewarming party. Joe has invited some old friends that he hasn't seen in years. He and his friends are all really excited to see each other again. Joe and his friends are talking together about the good old days they spent together at college. They're having such a great time. Suddenly, Joe realizes it's already 12 a.m. in the morning. It's time for all the guests to leave. Joe has been having so much fun that he didn't notice it had gotten so late. While saying goodbye to his friends, what would Joe most likely say to them? 대화를 듣고 여자가 남자에게 소개하려는 사람을 고르시오. Thank you for inviting me to your office party. No problem. This is a good chance for you to meet my boss. Maybe he will give me a job. Is he the friendly guy greeting the pretty girl? No, but he looks quite friendly. Is he the guy wearing a short-sleeved shirt? No, he's too young to be my boss. Is he the guy drinking from the glass? No, I'll give you a clue. My boss wears glasses. Then he's shaking hands? No, he's wearing a bow tie. He's introducing the other two people to each other. Oh, I see him now. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 고르시오. Mom, don't you know how much I love you? Don't go away. Come on, that's not very realistic. Okay, I'll do that line again. And make sure you pronounce more clearly. Mom, don't you know how much I love you? Don't go away. Your expression is too calm. Think about how tragic this scene is. All right, I'll try again. Your body gestures show overaction. Make it natural. But I'm trying to express the deep emotion. Let's give it another try. Sure. 대화를 듣고 여자가 운전한 차의 속도를 고르시오. May I see your driver's license? Sure. Did I do something wrong? Do you realize you are going 15 kilometers over the speed limit? No, I'm sure I was not speeding. I was going 5 kilometers under. No, don't you see that sign? Ah, it says 60 kilometer zone. Oh dear, I didn't see that. I just thought this area was an 80 kilometer limit zone. Well, I'll have to give you a ticket. Please let me go this time. I am late for a job interview. Okay. Well, I'll let you go this time, but please be careful in the future. 대화를 듣고 여자가 남자에게 원하는 것을 고르시오. Are you ready to order? Yes, I'll have the shrimp special. Okay, do you want something else? A glass of white wine, please. Oh, excuse me, sir, but you need to put that cigarette out. Oh, I'm sorry. It's a non-smoking area. Yes, sorry for the inconvenience. No problem. Is there a smoking area here? There's a room over by the elevator near the front door. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. Can I help you? I'd like to pick up my dress. May I have your name? Connie Chung. Is it ready? Sure, here it is. Let me see. Oh dear, look at this spot. It's still there. Yes, I use stain remover, but it wouldn't come off. Can you try again? It looks dirty. 
I'm afraid it's an old stain and there's not much we can do. Do you have a different stain remover? I'm afraid not. It's very small and no one will notice it. 다음에 듣고 남자가 무엇을 하고 있는지를 고르시오. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to introduce our guest speaker to you today. He is a former Olympic gold medalist in his sport of marathon. He has since trained other young players. He has been also traveling throughout the country, speaking to students, discussing the importance of staying in school, the need to stay away from drugs and alcohol, and the opportunities sports provide to all of us. Please join me in welcoming Mr. Max Lee. 다음에 듣고 아래에서 잘못된 부분을 고르시오. Don't forget about the art exhibit for three days from Thursday through Saturday in Coex Mall. 200 artists will be in town to show and sell their work. The admission for adults is $5, $3 for seniors, and $2 for children. The show is from 9 to 6. Come early and enjoy the day. 다음에 듣고 남자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, Laura. This is Thomas. I can't wait until I see you tomorrow. I've just heard that there's a house design contest in two weeks. Anyone studying architecture or art can enter the event. So I'm calling to say that we can do the design contest together. I've come up with a great idea. If we work on some details, I believe we'll be able to win the prize. So please give me a call as soon as you can. Thanks. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 화가 난 이유를 고르시오. I can't stand all this noise. It doesn't seem to have stopped. It's hard to concentrate on my work. I can't wait until the construction of that new building is finished. We should complain about that to the manager there. I have complained, but it didn't help. Do you know when they said they'd be finished? I heard next month. But big construction is always behind schedule. 대화를 듣고 남자의 아들에 대한 설명과 일치하는 것을 고르시오. I went to see the basketball game at school last week. So did I. My son is in the team. I saw him playing. Your son is an excellent basketball player. Thank you. He scored the most that day. You know my son was voted as the most valuable player in this region. That's great. Is he going to keep playing after going to college? Yes, and he just received an athletic scholarship from Kunst College. You must be very proud of him. 대화를 듣고 여자가 수요일에 하려는 것을 고르시오. The first month of my new job has been quite busy, but it turned out okay. Would you like to see a movie tonight? Sorry, I have art class on Wednesdays. So you work here during the day and attend school at night? Yeah, it's a little tough, but learning art is really interesting to me. Well, we need some time for a break. Then how about dinner on Friday? That's fine with me. 다음을 듣고 여자가 요청한 것을 고르시오. Before I begin today's session, I have to tell you something about today's reading materials. Because of some mistakes in printing in a small number of cases, the given material is missing some pages, and two copies of the same article have been put together in the material. So go over your reading material and make sure that its pages are correctly numbered. If you find some pages missing, let me know. I will replace it with a new one. Thank you. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. 1. Can you recommend a good camera? This new model works well. 2. You came out beautiful in this picture. It seems I'm photogenic. 3. What time do you go to bed? Usually around midnight. 4. Would you mind taking us a picture? No. How do you work this? 5. Where do you want to put up this poster? I'd like it beside the elevator. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. I heard that Jonathan is visiting Korea. Yeah, I met him last week and we had dinner. Oh, I was out of country at that time. That explains it. I tried to call you, but I couldn't reach you. I really hope I see him. Well, did you know he had a heart attack? What? I haven't heard about that. Yeah. 
He would have died if it hadn't been for his wife. Wow, that's lucky. She's a nurse, right? Yes, and she knew exactly what to do in that situation. I remember he was healthy. How is he now? 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What do you have in mind for your vacation? I'm thinking about going to Australia. Oh, are you? When are you planning to go? I want to go at Christmas time, but I'm worried it might be a little cold. Not at all. Australia has its summer when we have our winter. Oh, that's right. It's down under. It's a great chance to get away from the cold weather here. Have you been to Australia? Yes. I went there on my honeymoon. Where would you recommend I go? 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, who's calling? It's Sharon Smith from ABC. Oh, how are you? I'm fine. I need to know about the book. Yes, I'm working on it now. We hope that you would have it finished by today. I've written most of it, but I need to put the final touches to it. Well, how soon can you have it ready? Give me two more days. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 애니 친구 줄리아에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Anne is going to fly to New York. She's going to attend an international student exchange program at New York University. Anne also has a friend, Julia, living in New York. Julia offers to take the morning off work so that she can pick Anne up from the airport. But Anne has been to New York many times visiting her sister, and her sister can pick her up from the airport. In this situation, what will Anne most probably say to her friend Julia? 대화를 듣고 여자가 찾고 있는 사람을 고르시오. Wow, it's been ten years since we were in high school. My, you look exactly the same as you did in school. Let's go and meet some more of our old classmates. Yeah, I'd like to find Jane. Didn't you see her? No, where is she? She's not the one looking in the mirror. Does she have permed hair? No, I'll give you a clue. She has long hair. Okay, she's not the one sitting by herself. Right, she's talking to a guy. Oh, yes. They are staring at each other. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 고르시오. What seems to be the problem? There's no problem, but I want to travel with my dog to Japan. Hmm, then you'll need an animal's medical record. That's right. Can you do it for me? Is the dog registered here? Yes. He got all his vaccinations from here. Okay, I'll get the receptionist to take your details and bring up its record. Will it take long? No, I'll have it ready soon. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 만날 시각을 고르시오. Hello, can I speak to Dick? Speaking, this must be Daisy. How are you? Just fine. I'm calling to ask you if you're available this evening. I have nothing scheduled. I'd like to arrange a blind date for you. That sounds great. How about this evening at 6.30? Can we make it half an hour later? I'll have to be in the office until then. I can pick you up since I'll be downtown then anyway. All right. 대화를 듣고 남자가 즐겨 읽는 책을 고르시오. Do you like to read? I do, but I don't get much of a chance to read. What kind of books do you enjoy reading? I like to read historical, non-fiction books. Do you have a favorite author? Not really, because there are so many historians who have different points of views. How about you? I like to read comic books or mystery novels. You must like books by Agatha Christie. Sure, she is the best ever. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하는 장소를 고르시오. Would you like some help with your bag? I think I can handle it myself. I only have this one. All right. But there was a mix-up at the airport, and my luggage got sent to Tokyo by mistake. Oh, really? The airline promised to have it here to this hotel this evening. So do you want me to take care of it? Yes, please. I'll be out for a meeting. I'd be happy to do that for you. Okay. Then I'll call the airline to leave the bag with the front desk. 다음 뉴스를 듣고 무엇에 관한 보도인지를 고르시오. 
I'm Joan London on the Hour News. Seven college students have been arrested by police. After taking an advanced computer course at school, the seven boys learned to obtain passwords to school computers. Then, they used their home computers to change their academic record. But instead of improving their grades, they will probably be expelled from school and put into prison. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 언급한 사진을 순서대로 나열한 것을 고르시오. What are these pictures? They are photos of the places I stayed during my honeymoon. Oh, you traveled to more than one place? Yeah. First, we stayed by a beautiful lake, and we rented a small cottage. Wow, that looks really peaceful. Sure. Then we stayed at a small two-story hotel at the foot of a mountain. So, were you climbing? No. Who on earth goes climbing on their honeymoon? All right. So, what is this beautiful building? This is the big five-star hotel with a nice golf course. We stayed there two nights. 대화를 듣고 남자가 전화를 건 목적을 고르시오. Hello, Videoville. Hello, do you rent videos only? We also have new DVDs available at the store. I mean, can I buy some videos through your store? Of course. Good. I'd like to order one in your new catalog. Okay. Just tell me the item number and the title. The number is 2895, and the title is Shakespeare in Love. All right. When would you like to have it? I want it by the end of next week. No problem. We'll have it ready then. 대화를 듣고 남자가 지각한 이유를 고르시오. I'm sorry I'm late for today's meeting. No problem. A lot of people had trouble getting here. There was repair work on the bridge, and only one lane was open. Mmm, it must have been the worst on the way. Next time I'll check the traffic report before I leave. But you know, there's a new road you can take. Is that quicker? Sure, you can save 20 minutes during the rush hour. Yes, I'll give it a try tomorrow. I'll let you know about it after the meeting. 대화를 듣고 남자의 심장을 묘사한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Lucy. Any news? Yeah, you won't believe it. But I got a letter from Cindy today. No kidding. What's she up to now? Well, she's in Italy. Italy? She was in New York last time I heard. Well, now she's in Italy. She's teaching English at a language school. Teaching English? I thought she was doing cosmetic sales. I didn't know she's got any training in language teaching. She's a real dark horse. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자에게 제안한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Paula. How is your research going? Well, I've just started it. What is the topic? It's the future economy of Japan. Wow, it sounds very interesting. The book that you lent to me the other day was very helpful. Did you finish reading the book? Yes, but I still have some questions. The book doesn't explain enough. I have another new book in my office. You might want to read it. Good. Is it on the same subject? Yes, read it and it might help. 다음을 듣고 누가 누구에게 말하고 있는지를 고르시오. This theater being small, the actors and the other audience members would appreciate if you have your cellular phones off during the performance. After finishing the first half part of the show, there will be a 15-minute break, at which time you will have a chance to make and receive any phone calls. Thank you for your cooperation. 다음 그림의 상황에 가장 적절한 대화를 고르시오. One. What seems to be the problem? I had a stomach ache all night. Two. Are you ready to go? Please, wait one minute. Three. Did you put the bag in the car? Yes, it's in the trunk. Four. Would you take a look at the magazine? Well, I'll read it later. Five. Did you take the jacket to the cleaners? Not yet. I'll do that tomorrow. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, Steve. This is Kate. Kate, what are you doing? It's 10.30. I'm afraid I can't come to work today. I think I've caught that flu that's been going around. What? Today of all days? I know it's going to be a busy day, but I really can't get out of bed today. All right, all right. It isn't your fault. I'll try to handle things. Sorry again, Steve. 
남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. I'll go and get some orange juice. Go ahead. I've got some apples and bread. Do you need anything else? I need toothpaste. Okay, I'll pick it up. Would that be all? Mom, we're out of eggs and cheese. Oh, right. I'll get those right away. However, what do you have in your hands? Oh, Mom, I really want to have some chocolate. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. This restaurant seems a bit expensive, doesn't it? Yes, look at the wine list. Wow, $30 for a house wine? That's out of our price range. How about you? Yes, and everybody is dressed so formally. But we're wearing jeans. I thought it was a casual family restaurant. I guess not. I feel uncomfortable here. How about you? I don't like it here. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 부모님이 윌리엄에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. William lost one of his legs in a traffic accident. At first, he felt very depressed and frustrated. He had to learn to walk again with his new artificial leg. He had to practice walking every day, and sometimes he felt like giving up. But his parents gave him lots of encouragement and support. After a long time, he could walk again normally. One day, he decided to enter a running event at the school's sports day. He trained for three months, and on the day, he won the first prize in the race. In this situation, what did his parents most probably say to William?